Good day, this is Mike Schell from Convergent Design, and today I'd like to introduce you to the NanoFlash, the world's smallest professional HDSD recorder. The NanoFlash is super lightweight, small, consumes less than 6 watts of power, and records your video from either HDSDI or HDMI onto affordable, readily available compact flashcards. The NanoFlash is extremely versatile has a wide range of different recording options and supports virtually every NLE program available today. Let's take a quick look inside your camera. From the outside, the light first strikes a CCD or CMOS sensor. From there, the signal travels to an analog to digital converter. Then it travels over to a digital processing block where you do color correction and color adjustments. From there, the never compressed signal travels to your internal codec and is simultaneously output to the HDSDI or HDMI port. The heart of the NanoFlash is the Sony XDCAM 422 codec. This is exactly the same circuitry found in the high-end PDW700 and PDW850 cameras. The real difference is that instead of limiting the bitrate to only 50 megabit 422, we've unthrottled the codec. And so now you can go up to 100, 160, 220, and all the way up to 280 megabit iframe only. When you get up to those particular rates, it makes a tremendous difference in the picture quality. Well, here's just a couple of examples. If you're shooting at the popular rate of 100 megabit, and you've got 32 gig cards, each card is capable of holding 40 minutes of video. Suppose you're shooting at 280 megabits, our very highest quality. If you load the Nano Flash up with two 64 gig cards, then you're going to get a full hour of recording without even having to touch the box. When you record to the compact flash cards, you can use one of three different file formats. The Nano Flash is absolutely feature packed with all kinds of cool recording capabilities. Well, let me introduce you to the Next2 device. Now, one of the nice things about the Next2 device is that you can copy up to 15 32 gigabyte cards. Another option that we offer is that you can take the 50 megabit 422 files and copy them directly to a Sony XDCAM optical media. Here's the NanoFlash mounted on the very popular Sony EX3 camera. We've taken the standard Sony battery out and we've replaced it with this SWIT battery which has identical capacity but it has a very neat feature with a DTAP connector. The combination will give you about three hours of record time. When you turn off your EX3, the NanoFlash goes into a power down mode and reduces its consumption from 6 watts down to about 2 tenths of a watt. You can find the NanoFlash in a wide variety of different applications and on many of the networks. The NanoFlash is something that you'll use five years from now. You can use it with your camera today. It'll upgrade the quality of virtually every camera on the market. 